In the words of Gandhi ji, the earth provides enough to satisfy every man's need but not every man's greed. Good day to everyone. Today, the Secunderabad Public School is celebrating the Energy Conservation Day. It is observed every year on December 14th. The day focuses on making people aware of global warming and climate change and promotes efforts towards saving energy resources. We are presenting to you Utpreksha, the science exhibition, as a dedication towards the National Energy Conservation Day. Hello everyone, my name is Mahati Struti. I am studying second day in the Sikhindrabad Public School. Now let us know about some interesting science facts. Octopus has three hearts. We cut down 27,000 trees every day to make toilet papers. The first computer weight was 27 tons. The oldest living tree is 4,800 years old. It is in California. Mary Curie is the first scientist to get two Nobel Prizes. Only 1% of water on the planet is usable water. It takes 8 minutes for the sunlight to reach the air. What is science? Yes, it is a field of study that allows us to understand the world around us better. It is a study that involves observation, experiments, testing, etc. Now let us also see some fun riddles. Which table does not have legs? The answer is vegetable. What is the smallest room? The answer is mushroom. Everyone has it and no one can lose it. The answer is a shadow. What has a neck but no head? The answer is a bottle. Thank you. Eyes. <laughs> 
am Satik studying in Sikinabad Public School. Today I am going to explain project on drip water plant plantation. For this you need plastic pot with mud seeds, stands, plastic glass and one pipe. Join the stands and place a glass. Pour water, put a pipe as shown and place seed, seed in the pot. We need to punch a hole in the pipe so that the water drip from the pipe. I already did this 15 days back with marigold seeds. Drip water technique provides conservation of water and can help us watering a multiple plants from one source of water tank. Thank you. Good morning everyone. My name is Mananya. I am from grade 2. Today, I am going to tell about types of transport. What is a transport? Transport means movement of people, animals and goods from one place to another place. Now, I am going to explain about types of transport. There are four types of transport. Land transport. Transport through road, example, ambulance. Ambulance is used for medical services. Fire truck. Fire truck is used for fire accident occur. Cycle. Cycle is the best transport because it will not pollute it. Water transport. Transport through water. Example, boat. Boat is the slowest and cheapest transport. Air transport. Transport through air. Example, aeroplane. Aeroplane is the fastest means of transport. Rail transport. Transport through rail tracks. Example, train. Train runs on tracks. What is the common thing for all the vehicles? All the vehicles run on wheels. Thank you everyone. Hope you like my model.
everyone, I am Kanapti Bai from class 2A. Today I am going to present a project on good habits and good manners. Good habits and good manners are two, two concepts most of us are taught from childhood. However, many people don't thought, realize that there is a difference between good habits and good manners. <laughs> so, good habits refer to behavior that is that is useful to one's physical and uh, mental health. Whereas, good manners is is needed everywhere, whether you are in office, school, college, um, uh, train, bus. Hotel, playground, or at home. Thank you.
like this when it is day. The earth looked like this in the night. The sun said, take one round, I will give you day and night. Thank you. Under Ki Namaskar and Naperu Mananya, Nenu, the Sikindrabar Public Patashala Loni, Rendava Taradila Chabutunano, E. Rojo Nenu, Science Guruchi Chaputano, Science and Timti, Science and Tim, Avishkarana, Srishti, Prayagalu, Nijalu, Mariu, Ganankalu. Ipurupani, Vasta Valu Chaputano, Prapanchulu, Adipet, that's it too. California alone, I checked to buy a signal who fail as some words around. Propunchalo, I did pet the poo, titan or rim. Ah, ah, poo, elugo cante chala pet the di. Manam, rojo, inchu inchu, ilva edu vela, chetani costun namu, danito, kagitam, they are a chestun nam. Manava sherry rumlo, the bay. Shatam Niru Nindi Untai Anni Grahalalu Venus Gram Chala Vidiga Untundi Oka Bodhinka Tala Lekunda Kuda Vara Projudu Prataka Kaladu Yay! Purkana Purpaka Chaputano Akashandu Ambu Ambulo Chembu Chembulo Palo Everati Everati Chapana Now, in 
insert the thread into the circle and place it on the cup. Finally, with the help of your elders, lit the candle. Wow, what a candle is ready. It's very beautiful. I made it without wax. See everybody, we can make water candles in different colors and different ways. Hope you like my model water candle. If yes, please try this at home with your with the help of your elders. Thank you. Good morning friends. I am Bhuvan Sharad from class 2B. Today I am going to show a science experiment about expansion and contraction of air. Materials required. A bottle with a narrow neck. A balloon. And a two troughs. One troughs. One trough with hot water, one with cold water. Fix the balloon to the mouth of the bottle. Keep the bottle in the hot water troughs. The balloon, see, the balloon expands. Keep the same water in the cold water. See the balloon contracts. Inference. Air consists of tiny particles called molecules. When the bottle is kept in hot water, the heat causes molecules to move away from each other. Therefore, the air in the bottle increases and expands the balloon. When the bottle is put in cold water, the molecules come close to each other. Therefore, the balloon contracts. This exp experiment shows the, the air expands and contracts with, with change of temperature. Thank you. Good morning everybody. My name is Bana Singhu. I'm staying in Peninsula. Production, Stephen Abbas Poppy School. I'm going to tell you about process of feed generation. The, the feed will absorb the water and it will, it will grow as a baby plant. That is called, called as process of seed germination. See, there is my chart. For the seed, we need water, sunlight, air, and nice soil. See, this is seed, a sprout, a sapling, and a, a baby plant, and some bear plant, and this is a plant, and after some days, it will begin as a tree. See, this are the, these are the seeds, sprouts, some saplings, see the saplings, it, it is getting, getting a bit, some leaf from the See, this getting sprouts. See, this getting some sprouts. And see, this baby plant and some bigger plants. And this is big plants. And from after some days, it will, it will begin as a big plant. And it will give you water. It will give you fresh air, fruits, and vegetables like this. Flowers. Flowers. And nice flowers, some vegetables, 
and some fruit. Thank you everybody. This is called as process of seed germination. Thank you. Hello everyone. My name is Sheikh Rufman Awan. Studying in first B from DC Kanabat Public School. Today I am going to tell you some amazing facts. Do you know a mosquito has 47 teeth? Wow! Most people blink about 17,000 times a day. Wow! It's great! Giraffes are unable to cough. <coughs> Ants do not sleep. Can you believe it? Now let's have some fun with riddles. Can you solve it? Let's see. Who is the queen of fruit? Think of it. Yeah, it's mangosteen. Which animal's blood is blue in color? Think of it. Yeah, it's octopus. Hope you all enjoyed it. Thank you. Hello friends, my name is Dirk in the Cup. I am from class first. A. Today my topic is our world. You want to learn about our universe? Come, I will show you. There, there, there are mountains. There is one sun. There, there is sky. There, are, there is river. There are animals and there are Beautiful trees. We be on planet Earth. This is sun. Sun give us heat, light and energy. Sun teaches us to live meaningful life. This is sky. It teaches us that there is no limit. You can go high as you want. These are mountains. They teach us to be strong. These are, these are trees. They give us fruits. They teach us giving for giving. This is river. Fearless and flowing. It teaches us where there is a will, there is a way. But we are not taking proper care of our nature. We should protect our earth. Sun rises in the east. Sun gives us sunlight. So days are hot and sunny. Sun sets in the, in the west. Sun sets in the evening. And it is night. It becomes night and the sky is dark. We can see moon and stars in the sky. Clouds in the sky give us rain. When rain stops and the sun comes, we see beautiful rainbow. Now we will see our solar system. There are eight planets in our solar system. This is sun. This is Mercury. Mercury is closest to the sun. This is Venus. Venus is the hottest planet of a solar system. This is our own planet. It is Earth. Earth is on the planet which supports life. Earth is covered by, by water. It is Mars. It is also called the red planet. This is Jupiter. Jupiter is the biggest planet of the solar system. 
planets in the fullest planet of the solar system. And the last one is Neptune. Neptune is made of gas. These are the planets of the solar system. We should protect our mother earth. No earth, no birth. Nature does not depend on us. But we depend on nature. So save nature, protect nature. Grow more trees and, and stop pollution. Thank you. Have a nice day. Good morning everyone. My name is Muhammad Wasif. I am from class 1. Today I am going to tell you about traffic signal light. The first traffic signal light was used in London. Traffic light is positioned for controlling traffic at roads, junctions, pedestrian crossing and roundabouts. It has universal color code red, yellow, green. Red for stop, yellow for wait, green for go. It is used to improve safety and helpful in minimizing road accidents and reduces travel time and traffic jam. Here are here are some traffic rules which we have to follow. We should cross the road using zebra crossing. We should cross the road only with elders. We should we should never turn the road. Use always use a footpath to walk. Do not use mobile phones while driving. Wear helmet and seat belt. So start early. Drive slowly. Eat safely. Thank you. Because they don't get water to drink. 
Birds and animals need our care. Thank you. My teachers and my dear friends, I am Fresh Kavya, studying in class 1A. Farmhouse and this all homes of animals are made by skating box, shoes box and some wedding cards. We, we have used my all toys. This lighting we use all on all festivals. Today I am going to tell about farm animals and some interesting facts about them. Farm animals are some farm animals are animals that are kept for agricultural purposes. They help farmers in their works. They are called they are they include horses, cows, sheep, goats, hens and dogs and etc. They 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 also called livestock. They provide us healthy products. This is a hot hot in the farm goes nine 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 all day long. Horse live in a stable. Horse eat Grass, hay. It it carry peoples and heavy weights. Horses horses are helpful in bullock carts. Friends, do you know interesting fact about horse? It can sleep while standing up. This is a cow. The cow in the farm goes moo 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 moo. All day long. Cow is in a shed. The young one of a cow is called a calf. Cow eats grass, grains, hay and oats. Cow gives us milk. In India, we worship cow as a mother. Friends, do you know interesting fact about cow? It can recognize the name. This is a sheep. The sheep in the farm goes ba 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 all day long. Sheep lives in a pen. The young one of a sheep is called a lamb. Sheep eats leaves, grass. Sheep gives us wool. Friends, do you know interesting fact about sheep? It can drink. Sheep don't have upper jaw teeth. This is a hen. The hen in the farm goes cluck, 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 cluck all day long. Hen lives in a coop. The young one of a hen are called chick. Hen eats grains. It gives us eggs. Friend, do you know interesting fact about chicks? It can make 200 different noises. This is a dog. The dog in the farm goes bow, 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 bow all day long. Dog lives in a kennel. The young one of a dog is called a puppy. Dog eats bones. Then do you know an interesting fact about dog? It has nice smell, sense of smell. Thank you. Have a nice day. Good morning everyone. My name is Ashit Tita. I'm studying in class 1 from the Sikhinabad Public School. Today I would like to discuss about plants like types of plants, parts of plants. <coughs> Can we imagine our world without plants? No. If there are no plants, we cannot breathe. 
we see plants all around us. Facts. Now let's see some facts about plants. Bamboo is a rapid growing plant. Avocado and tomatoes are actually fruits. Raffaella is the largest growing flower. Types of plants. Trees. Tall big plants are called trees. Trees have strong stem called trunk. For example, apple apple tree, mango tree, banyan tree. Climbers. Small Small of stems of some plants are weak. They are called climbers. For example, bean plant, money plant, grapevine plant. Shrubs. Shrubs are shorter than trees. Some have woody stem. Example, rose plant, sunflower plant. Herbs, small plants with weak stems are called herbs. For example, spinach, mm, spinach mm, and grass. Creepers. Some plants go along ground. They are called creepers. Example, pumpkin plant, watermelon plant. Now comes parts of plants.
at Zebra Crossing. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Trainers of Jasper. Today I am going to tell you about the world of animals. The earth is not just our home planet, but home for many animals. Animals are living things like us. They are different kinds and sizes. Some are tall, some are short. They also eat food, play, run and hunt. Animals are categorized into two types. Wild animals and domestic, domestic animals. Animals that get pet home or in the farm are called domestic animals. Example, cow, dog, cat, etc. Animals that live in Animals that live in forest are called wild animals. Example, tiger, lion, elephant, jizzar, etc. Some animals live in water. Example, fish, etc. Animals like duck, frog, crocodile live in both on land and water. Insects are small animals with six legs. Example, bees, beetles, ladybug, cockroach, etc. Mostly them have wings help them to fly. I would like to say an animal eyes have power to speak great language. Hope you all liked it. Thank you. Public school. My project is about sources of water. Do you know sources of water? Sources of water is natural sources of water and man-made sources of water. Natural sources of water is rain, stream, river, lake. Sea and pond. Man made sources of water is well and hand pumps. Rainwater gets collected into stream, river, lake, sea, and pond. Sea water is very salty water. So we can use fresh water from stream, river, lake and pond. So we can use groundwater from well and hand pumps. So we do not waste water. We should use carefully. Thank you. Hello everyone. My name is Sakshi. I am studying in first class. My school name is Sikindabar Public School. Today I am telling about types of plants. There are five types of plants. This is a tree. This is a creepers. This is a climbers. This is a shrubs. Plants are called trees. Plants that need support to stand are called climbers. Short and bushy plants are called shrubs. Small plants with weak stems are called herbs. Plants that grow along the ground are called creepers. Plants need air. Sunshine and water to grow. We water the plant. Hello everyone. My name is Sadiq Saibanala. I am studying in class 1B in the Sukhinabha Public School. Now, now, 
Now I'm going to tell about domestic animals. Some animals will live at house, some animals will live at farm. They are called domestic animals. Come, come, I'm going to show my farm. I have more, lots of animals. I'm going to share the, show them. Cow. Cow lives in, no, cow lives in their shed. Cow young one is a calf. Cow gives us milk. Cow eats grass. Cow, and milk is very healthy for our health. Hen. Hen is in a coop. Hen young one is a chick. Hen gives us egg. Egg is very healthy. Duck. Duck is in a pond. Duck young one is duckling. Sheep. Sheep lives in a pen. Goat lives in a pen. Sheep young one is a lamb. Sheep gives us sheep gives us wool. And sheep fur will be very soft. Horse. Horse lives in a stable. Horse young one is a fall. Horse will let us ride on it and also they use horse like a transport. Dog. Dog lives in a kennel. Dog young one is a puppy. Dog guards our house and dog is our best friend. You should not hurt the animals. They do lots of help for us. You like my farm? Do you like my farm? Thank you. My name is Banagar. I study in Bambi. India is the land of a festival. Festival is a special day celebrated with a group of a people. There are many festivals. Like Diwali, like Lodi, like Eid, like Christmas. Eid, Eid, Diwali is a festival of Hindu. Lodi is a festival of Punjabis. Christmas is a festival of Christians. Eid is a festival of Muslims. Diwali, we burn crackers, eat lots of weeds and pray <laughs> like lambs. Lodi, we burn fire and dance. Christmas, Santa give gifts and decorate trees. Eat, eat. We eat lots of pee and pray for. Eat Muvaratto. They, in, they, in, Unity in India. Thank you. Hello everyone. My name is Shams of Class 1. Today I am going to tell about importance of plants. Plants are living organisms belonging to the vegetal kingdom that can live on land or in water. Plants have the unique ability of producing their own food through a process called photosynthesis. In this process, plants are able to produce macromolecules such as carbohydrates that cannot be produced in humans or animals. One reason we depend on plants is for consumption. Now let me tell you how plants are important in our life. Plants are really important for the planet and for the all living things. Plants absorb carbon dioxide and release oxygen for the humans and other animals need to breathe. When plants release all living things, plants need to live. They eat them and they live in them. Plants give us food, medicines, Paper, rubber, pollution remover, perfumes, etc. Finally, I would like to say plants give oxygen for the lungs and for the soil. Hope you all liked it. Thank you. Morning, everyone.
everyone my name is ganesh i am studying in first class a section today i am going to say about me means of transport there are th three ways of transport waterways land ways and airways land ways i want to go anywhere how will i go i can walk or i can run but i want to go far distance how will i go i can go by car but car auto bicycle and bus and train hmm bus stop say bus stop train stop say railway station these vehicles move move on wheels these vehicles help helps us to move to one place to another waterway ships and boats travel on water they are slowest means of transport always means of transport and they stops at harbor aeroplanes and helicopters travel by air they are very costly and they are fast fastest means of transport they land and take off to airport at airport thank you
And we have to fold in the container. And we want sugar. We have to add a tablespoon of sugar. Two spoons. And we have want the soap. And we pour in the container. And one spoon. And we have to mix it well. And we have to pour in glass. And we have to add in the table on the table. And we have to rub, rub the table. And we want to stop. And we add uh, again. Well done guys, subscribe this video and ring the bell.